I didn't really know too much about it before I came. And my husband signed up. I wasn't going to come. I thought, well, if he's willing to go, I'll go too. I didn't have any expectations about exactly how the data would run. But I did feel like we would learn something about our meeting and that we would also learn about the Quake Request process. And I did learn those things. That, that all came true. I love the opportunity for small, intimate conversations and really long for that. And, and this was a day where there was a, a good amount of that. I like the, quote, speed dating exercise, <laughs> the one where there was an inner circle and an outer circle, and you were given questions that you had to either answer or listen to the other person's answer and then move. The questions were important questions that we all think about but seldom get a chance to talk with each other about. And so that helped me learn two things. One, what people think and where their own heads are at. And then, you know, more about them and how they think about those deeper kind of questions, how deep they go themselves. And I discovered that basically everybody is pretty darn deep. There's a lot I don't know. So it was a challenge for me to answer those questions. And it was really interesting to hear other people answer their questions because they were people that I might not talk to. For me, it was like, oh my goodness, you know, I know what I believe. But to try to put that in a larger context is, you know, is to speak for the whole meeting. One thing that's very helpful is to have the exercises that invite us to take the perspective of a newcomer or a potential newcomer. And, you know, as a newcomer, how do we find our way in? What do we see when we get here? What's the experience of coming into this space? And with a desire to get involved, what helps it? What hinders it? I think when you live in a community, it's really hard to also bring change to that community. Sometimes it takes somebody from outside who can come in and get everybody excited and then leave, you know? I feel like I, I'm so inspired and I'm going to be meditating on this or contemplating the things that we talked about for probably months to come. I feel very much engaged in looking deeper into Quakerism and exactly, you know, what, I, what it is I do believe. I hope that it is part of our continuing to sort of plumb the depths of our own experience and what we are and at the same time offers the opportunity for uh, more people to get engaged. I think just like any good conversation, the more people that are involved in the conversation openly, the deeper the conversation is going to get. Sharing who we are will let other people share who they are. And even if our church doesn't change, we can be more part of the community. Just at the end of the day, I felt tired, but I also felt just warm, you know, like these are my people, you know.